Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to import the FBX 3D models into Character Creator 4 together with all of the morph targets like the facial expressions, like the lip sync, all related to the facial. All will be inside the morph targets. Alright, so start from now, I'm going to show you the step by step. Now, this is my Character Creator 4. At the same time, I have a 3D model, an FBX file. This FBX file is a 3D model that included the facial expression morph target. So how are we going to import it into Character Creator 4 to make it become a non-standard human, human 3D avatar together with the morph targets of the facial expressions and lip sync. The first step, just drag in, import as character, Select the center one, the non-standard humanoid, then click apply. Then the next step is just go and map the bone. This is what we call the characterization. You have to just map it one by one if you doesn't have any of the profile. Just map it one by one. Right, just left a few pieces of bones. Then this skeleton will be completed. Right, once done already, just click active and then click characterization. Next, we are going to import the morph. To import the morph, you have to go to here, click the facial profile editor, then it will appear right here. You can toggle it here, facial profile editor, then click edit expressions. The batch imports here, the batch imports you have to import the FBX file just now. The FBX file just now is at here, so you have to open on the desktop, the avatar01. Now we can see all of the facial morph, the facial expressions and lip sync morph already get imported. The target category, you have to just name it as morph. It's easy, then click OK. Now you can see all of the facial expression morph already imported into the character Creator 4. So that's all for today about how to import the FBX 3D avatar with the morph targets in your character Creator 4. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials and sharings, if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animations and 3D game developing. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new videos, tutorials or sharings, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animations and 3D game developing. See you!